quick video. If you've been watching the news, you'll know the trial of Julie Schenecker in Florida is going on. Julie Schenecker was the shaken mother that killed her two children. Uh, they have found some damning, damning evidence. Julie Schenecker apparently kept a journal. Uh, in that journal, journal, one of the entries said, if you're wondering why I decided to take out the kids, it's to protect them. Uh, claiming that children of bipolar uh, parents tend to uh, think of suicide and she wanted to save them from that pain and that fate so she was afraid they were going to commit suicide so she just went ahead and did it for them uh, they were, both kids were shot in the back of the head Calix the daughter was shot in the mouth uh, also one of the uh, entries in the journal had stated what she was going to do and had stated that Calix is going to get it first um, her husband took the witness stand today and was saying that uh, his daughter, Calix, had a problem with her mother, her mother's drinking, saying, you know, telling her dad she didn't want to get in the car with her anymore because her mom was drinking too much and she was afraid that they were going to get in a crash and die. Uh, apparently, Julie Schenecker had talked to her husband about the children also because he stated that he told her she was the adult in the situation and she should act as such. So, apparently, she was being quite childish about the whole situation. Um... I think this is day two of the trial. Her attorneys are going for the uh, insanity plea, uh, citing uh, that it was her medication and her being bipolar that caused her to do it. Uh, she, uh, she on, on another page, she scribbled an apology to her husband and said that she believed... Uh, well, the couple got divorced and Parker Seneca retired from the military after this. And in the diary, she wrote, Parker, I'm sorry, so sorry. I don't know what to say, but I sensed divorce was inevitable. But I can't live alone. Uh, she also writes in her journal that uh, it's time that she's sending the kids on to heaven. And she's going to, and it's time for them to go home. So, she was just weird. Also, on another page in her journal... They said it was a repetitive right of, you're a failure, you're a failure, you're a failure. So, uh, she also claims that she was going to kill herself too, but she fell asleep. So anyway, that's what's going on in day two of the trial. And they'll probably bring some more up about the journal, and we'll see what it says. And until next time, bye-bye.